Well, hello, Defiers, and welcome to Mikey's Gaming Oasis. Well, I got some exciting news. I'm sure some of you have seen it already in the Discord. I was curious, since we haven't had any updates in about a month, so I hit up Monday uh, through Discord to see what tidbits and tantalizing information she may have for us. And let's just say she did not disappoint yet again. Uh, I have to give it up to the community managers that for Donna Defiance. They are amazing, taking care of us, keeping us up to date, and giving us new information as it comes out with the status and updates for this amazing game. Well, one thing that I found out when she sent me this information, and right before she posted it and it went live, is that exciting news. The patch is now coming a week earlier than we thought she states here hello defiers we hope you've been having a beautiful autumn november in our last article we told you our next patch would be coming november 22nd but we're officially ahead of schedule the next patch focused on combat and ai improvements will instead be coming november 22nd that's this friday guys three days away that's a full week before we were supposed to get it this allows you to play the updates more during your thanksgiving break and allows us more time to, to work with players to clean up any surprise bugs before the holidays of course you know as well as i do the bugs come out of the woodworks with every update and you the defiers who play this game Letting them know and keeping them up to date in Discord on what bugs you're finding is what is allowing them to stay ahead of the game on this game. Well, that sounded funny. But you know what I mean. So, keep up the good work to fires in giving our friendly devs the information they need to improve this game. The next bit of good news that we got is that they are going to be at the... OTK Network uh, Expo, Winter Games Expo, in De on December 4th, and that's where they're going to be giving us our the newest updates on the roadmap. Now, I know some of you kind of are wondering, when are we going to get certain things? Uh, and one thing that I've been asked by some of our viewers in live streams as well as in my Discord is... When are we going to get the female protagonist? Well, I don't have an exact answer for you, but she did tell me that it will be discussed in the upcoming roadmap coming out December in the time frame of December 4th during the expo. So keep an eye out for that. Okay. It's going to tell us what's coming up for this game. Keep an eye out. Trust me. It's going to be amazing. I have no doubt everything they've put out so far, they're doing an amazing job keeping us updated and listening to our advice and no, so sh they know what we're looking for and what we want to see out of this game and they're trying to deliver it as we've seen as this game is developed. So make sure you pay attention to it. So let's go over some housekeeping here. Some of the things that they're that they're working on is ore polish. Uh, they're... Basically, what they're trying to do is they're trying to make the resource nodes more available throughout the crossroads and both islands so that you don't have to go completely across the crossroads, the, into the main island, to find one ore or the other. They're making them uh, more abundant as well as working on the animations as well as the look of them to allow them to be more noticeable and distinguishable between each other because let's be honest there are certain ones that do kind of look the same if your graphics aren't turned up to god mode freaking uh ultra okay so they're trying to make that fix for us so that we can then uh easily identify our resources that we're hunting for for those grinders uh animation updates one of the big ones they're working on is the downward strike. As you can see in this video here, they are working on having that downward swipe actually have a associated animation that makes sense for a sword coming down at 100 miles per hour. You know, so 
from the video here, I think it's going to look amazing. So I can't wait to see that in the game, in the update on the 22nd. One of the other things that they're going to be doing is they're going to be adding new lootables, guys. That's right, new lootables. So when you take down an enemy, it's going to give you special foods that now we can't make them, but it is going to increase certain aspects of us that we can eat from collecting them. Okay, now will it be something we can make later on? We'll see. Uh, I think that would be an interesting aspect of the game. But it uh, right now, they are going to be putting those in as loot drops. Looking forward to that as well. And then, of course, you have the AI uh, improvements, one of which is the boar charge. Most of us know, if you're any kind of a country folk, you know that boars can be extremely territorial and aggressive, and they are very strong animals. So what are they doing? They're putting a knockback on the boar charge headbutt. So if you get hit by that boar, instead of it bouncing off of you, you're going to be bouncing off of it, and it's going to knock you back, even if you're guarding. So make sure you got that shield up when you're going against those freaking uh, boars so they don't knock you all the way to kingdom come. And then, of course, they're working on the stamina regain bug. Mm, that's a little weird. Uh, once you run out of... Uh, stam and you land in the water for some reason your stam bar just doesn't want to regain as its normal speed if at all sometimes once you get out of that water so they're working on fixing that to make it easier for us to uh, enjoy the game the way it is intended and then of course you have the balloon rocks I'm going to pop this video up from them showing that. If you haven't seen this bug, it's actually quite comical. So here's the video of it. As you can see, it's obviously Monday uh, harvesting some ore. And as soon as she bro uh, hit the rock enough, the it just floated away like it's fully helium. So hopefully they'll be fixing that soon with the update. And then, of course, in here we have our bonus the new creature, that, the new mystery creature that is coming soon to the desert to enhance our experience. And it, it's a new enemy. Uh, it gives us this little teaser trailer here. Really blurry. Uh, sh so let's have a little fun with this, guys. Look at this video. You tell me what you think it is. And post it in the Defiant Dawn of Defiance Discord. Or, you can also post it in my Discord. I know my personal guess is skeletons. I think it's going to be the skeleton army coming out of the desert to get ya. But, uh, we'll see. Uh, so, special thanks to Monday and the admins who do an amazing job with Dawn of Defiance. And we hope to see, really looking forward to see what you guys do next. Can't wait to see it. Take care. And we'll see you on the crossroads, guys.